G'day guys, welcome back to Rusty's Garage. Um, the room is almost complete. Uh, as you can see behind me, um, there's still some boxes and stuff to remove. Um, uh, but yeah, a couple of couple more cars to hang, uh, that kind of thing. But um, obviously over time, there'll be more stuff to put up as well. So as I collect more stuff. So um, we'll put a video up later on, uh, a tour of the room once it's complete and everything's moved out that doesn't have to be in here. Um, but for today, um, I wanted to do some more openings of some cars. Uh, these aren't Hot Wheels cars, they're called metal machines. Uh, Zuru metal machines to be exact. Um, so this is them, we'll go into a bit more in depth uh, on them um, as we open them up. Um, they are pretty, pretty cool looking cars. Um, there's a lot more than just these four, but these are just the four that stood out to me. Um, so we'll, we'll crack them open in a minute and we'll compare them to um, Hot Wheels cars and uh, what, the, what the quality is and stuff like that. They all look like they've got metal bases, um, which is pretty cool. Um, yeah, so we'll get, that, um, we'll get that underway right now. Okay, so let's get cracking with these uh, Zuru metal machines. Uh, so we'll start off with this guy, he's called the cadet um like i say they don't have like proper names and no branding uh, you know like no car manufacturer branding so no chev no nothing like that so uh this one has by the looks of it got flash wolf written on the side of it i think by the looks of that no badging no nothing like that it looks like a off-road camaro um so yeah, we'll, we'll get him out and we'll have a look and see what the quality is like. So yeah, they look alright, they're not... Yeah, they're metal bases. Metal bases on those. Um, they look pretty cool. The, um, the actual castings themselves, um, uh, some of them, some parts are metal. That grey part there is metal. The, the um, tealy colour on the side is plastic. Um, but yeah, no, they look all right. You know, for for a cheaper cheaper casting, they um, they're still pretty cool. You've got the chrome roll bars and all that. The tyres in the rear, so um, the detail's pretty good. You know, the lights on the top. No, there's no decos on the rear or on the front or anything like that. The chrome grill and all that kind of gear. So, yeah, that looks pretty cool. So the next one we will do is the Flare. Um, looks like a Camaro to me. Um, don't know what that is written on the side of it there. But yeah, Zuru metal machines, nice goldy color, with the black and silver stripes at the side, chrome wheels, that's pretty cool too. So there you go, again, metal base, that's plastic. Um, the grill is the same color as the glass, Again, no decos on the rear, no on the front. Pretty basic cars, but they still look pretty cool. Um, it says 026 on the rear, and I'm not sure what that says there. Camera won't focus on it. But anyway, yeah, no, that's cool. That's pretty cool. That one with the blue glass. It looks like it's got chrome interior. So yeah, that's pretty cool too. Sorry guys, we had a camera malfunction there. Um, so the next one is the Chase, and it's a police car, obviously. Um, it looks pretty cool. I don't know, it looks like a, the front end looks like a Toyota A86. So we'll get him out and have a closer look. Well, I think... Uh, you guys in the US call them a sky on. Um, so yeah, that's pretty cool for a police car. Blue, it's got a little 
a little radar point on the top there. It's got the nudge bar on the front. That's really cool. I like that. Metal base again. These things are really cool with the metal bases. You could possibly use these bases if you wanted to swap on a metal base for something else. But yeah, no, that's really cool. Police car. Again, very basic. I think this one might be metal. I'm not sure. Feels like it could be, actually. But yeah, no, that's pretty cool, too. And the last one is called the Signal. I don't know these names. Um, this one looks like a Ford, maybe. An old Ford pickup. Drag truck. Again, pretty cool. Those wheels are really nice. They're nice, those wheels are cool. Metal base. Um, all plastic else, but... Uh, cool motor popped down at the top there. Uh, chrome interior to go along with the chrome um, roll bars and the chrome exhaust. Yeah, another cool casting. Um, I'll probably grab some more of these next time I'm at the shop because um, there was quite a few more. There's like a couple of four-wheel drive ones and, and that kind of thing. And um, Yeah, I don't know. You could probably customise some of these pretty well, so... So yeah, there you go. That's the Zuru Metal Machines. Um, look, in comparison to the Hot Wheels, um, yeah, look, they're not they're not made as well. Um, the castings are actually plastic. The bases are only metal, um, so you can't really call them metal machines, I guess. Um, so yeah, we'll have a flyover of them now, and um, yeah, we'll go from there. So guys, that's pretty much it for this video. Um, I did also pick up the other day the new Car Culture American Scene set. So that's that one there. Uh, unfortunately, no chase car, um, but that set will go up on the wall, on the pegs with the rest of the premiums. Um, but yeah, I just, I guess I just wanna let you guys know just a little bit of a backstory into Rusty's Garage. Um, I suffer from end stage renal failure. Um, so uh, it makes it hard to get out and about to actually um, look for anything um, and due to the fact that I have renal failure uh, I don't work so um, this this uh, collection here is pretty much funded by my wife um, so it's it's um, hers just as much as it is mine um, she doesn't share the passion that I do for collecting the cars but um, she does look every time she goes to the shops for me, so um, that's a that's a big plus. Um, I guess I collect these things. Um, one day they'll be passed on to my children. Um, I guess that's something that I can leave them. Um, uh, they'll be able to benefit from them, I suppose, um, in, in the long run. Um, but yeah, I'll keep collecting as long as I can. Um, and uh, depending on how much room I have left um, to collect, but I'm sure I'll find space somewhere. Um, so yeah, guys, I'll give you a really, really quick flyby of the room um, at the end of this video. Uh, I don't wanna go in too much depth yet because it's not finished and there's still boxes and, and crap laying around the place. So um, once it's all cleared out and it's all properly set up, I'll, I'll do a, a, a bit by bit um, of the collection uh, just so you guys can see how it's set up uh, and what I've got. So. Uh, it's just not it's not just die cast. I've got some figures. I've got some old toys as well a couple of really old battery operated robots um, That I've had for a little while now um, And yeah, and just little bits and pieces that um, I've found around around the place um, 
and things that I've had for quite a while. Um, I've got um, a whole heap of Beyblades that belong to my kids um, that I seem to have inherited. But anyway, they're, they're sitting um, here beside me and uh, I'll, I'll sort them out one day and see if I can sort out somehow to um, maybe hang them on the wall, um, rig something up to put them in because some of the Beyblades are quite cool. Uh, and some of them are quite rare as well. So, um, so guys, um, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Um, the more you guys watch this channel, um, you know, the more more I can get, more more content I can get out to you guys. So, um, I'd really like to increase the subscriber limit, um, and that that's up to you guys. If you um, can share um, my channel to all your friends, uh, your family and um, just get it out there. Um, I, I, I collect cars just because I, I love them. They're, they're just so cool. Um, all the cars, things that Hot Wheels make and Matchbox and, and just, not just those guys but everyone are really, really cool. Um, I guess it takes you back to when you were a kid, a much simpler time in life um, when things weren't so hectic and uh, you know, all that mattered in life was a toy car in your hand. So, um, the more that I can get that out to you guys there, the better. Um, and, and yeah, so like I said, like, share and subscribe. Share this to all your friends. Um, and like I always say, until next time, see ya.